lands the impaler. Minoru Suzuki was looking for that Fujiwara arm bar. You see it right here. And just a good counter by Cope and just drives Suzuki on, on his head. But importantly, Taz, Copeland has not been able to capitalize on that. He dropped Suzuki, but was unable to go for a pinfall attempt. Yeah, no, he's trying to recover. That's what it is. The battle between both these men here. Suzuki looking to compose himself. After the impaler, Copeland back up, perhaps with a nominal advantage. And now maybe thinking spear on Suzuki. No, Suzuki so goes nothing. through the Fujiwara armbar. And he's got it tight. And that armbar, Minoru Suzuki, I mean, he learned it from the namesake of Fujiwara, his, his former mentor, Yoshiaki Fujiwara, the man who invented this hold, and Suzuki has it locked in tight. Well, that guy's got that elbow cupped. It's not even the key is keeping the back of your arm on the back of his shoulder, right? and keeping your hip on the mat like Suzuki did to stay tight to your opponent, but good match sense by Cope to get to that bottom rope. Yeah, I think if they were any closer to the center of the ring, Suzuki might have taken that one. That'd be a submission. Go for a rear choke. The choke, uh, no. Oh, the turnbuckle uh, pad came Cope, off. Copeland hung on to that. He's grabbing on for dear life. Get off the ring out of that. As Copeland, the spear! Oh, that might be it. Can he cover him? Here we go. Suzuki might be done. The near leg is hooked, and Suzuki! Kick out. Well, you see how close Bryce Rensburg hand watch the map. Yeah, good job by referee Bryce Rensburg. He, oh, he, Suzuki just rising up. As, now look at this position himself in. He's got that rear naked sleeper locked in tight. Got the legs in too. Got to turn to the side, Cope. Turn to the side and now get some wrist control and get out of this thing. Yeah, you see Cope when he's trying to trying to relieve the pressure, trying to. Take Suzuki's arm off, off of Copeland's carotid artery. He's doing the right thing, and hence why he's basically almost getting out of this choke. And oh, look at Suzuki wrenching up. Copeland, his face is telling the story. He is fading fast. Yeah, he's turning purple. You just got to get a couple of fingers in there, but I think he's getting choked out. He's literally purple right now. Look at that, Suzuki just wrenching up. Is this the end of the Cope Open? It appears so, guys. Bryce Rensburg on the verge of stopping this match. Yeah, he might be choked, choked out here. That's one, no, Copeland, Copeland's up. Gonna try and arm drag him out of this thing, watch Ooh. out! And, oh, Suzuki, going into that unprotected turnbuckle in the corner. I think he went in chin first. Uh-oh, 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 watch out here. Copeland, the kill switch on Minoru Suzuki. A clear message to Christian Cage is that it is! Copeland victorious tonight, but the inadvertent assist from that uncovered turnbuckle opened the path for Copeland. And there you see Christian Cage, the TNT champion, the man in the sights of the rated R superstar looking on it. He does not seem impressed at all, Taz. He looks disgust. Christian looks disgust seeing that Edge got the victory over Suzuki. The Rated R Superstar. The kill switch on Minoru Suzuki to score the win. What a main event tonight on Dynamite. He's 4-0 is Adam Copeland. He's asking for a microphone here. Yeah, but this number four is going to need uh, a lot of recoup time for number five. I can tell you that. Look at this. <laughs> Uh, I've never been hit that hard in my life. God damn it. Uh. Suzuki. Uh. Respect.
And Suzuki obviously not taking the loss easily. Like he feels like... Honestly, I would have been disappointed if he did shake my hand, wouldn't you? That was a war. The kind of war that Christian Cage knows nothing about. Christian, I am still coming for you. The climb back to the TNT Championship still underway for the Rated R Superstar. Christian Cage, you have commands, will do anything in his power to avoid another match with Adam Copeland. But how long can he outrun him?